Previously on Teen Mom 2. I will have to have your high school transcript mm -hmm. in a month. Okay. Do you want to try for us again? Yeah, I'm ready to settle that one with you and her. I met somebody at work. His name's Jordan. I like you and everything you bring to the table. You know how bad you look going to hang out with another guy? You want to date other guys? Not while you're living in my house. Hi, Jordan. I don't think we can be together. I'm just going to sign over custody. That's a wise decision. Right here, I have your name for you to sign it. I don't get how a baby can't put weight on her leg. I think it's fair. She might not be able to walk. What do you think about taking it to the next level? Corey? Things with Corey and I have been going great. My mom and friends think I'm moving a little fast but I couldn't be happier to be a family again. Today, we're going to spend the day with Corey's family at the beach. OK, let's put your swimmer trunks on. Does it matter which bathing suit you guys on which baby? No. Which one? That one? OK. Does it go like that or like the that? The bows on the front. To make sure them baby's all some blocked up. Corey. <laughs> Boo! <laughs> I saw you. <laughs> I was watching for my girls. Who's gonna get in what? No matter. Here's one for one of them. Oh. What are you doing, baby? <laughs> <laughs> oh, you spray in the face. Watch yourself again. Let's go to the beach. You see the ocean? You wanna put your feet in the water? Ready? Oh no. Uh oh. All of us been together on the beach. All of us together on the beach. Yay! What do you think, Allie? Oh, Ooh. Dad, she just. <laughs> when you're a mommy, you're not gonna have the nicest clothes. Even though Meg is not thrilled about it, Adam's been hanging out a lot. And it's nice because for once, he's helping me with Aubrey. Today I should be studying, but instead, Adam and I are taking Aubrey to the zoo. Okay, jeez. Okay, I don't care. One time I went to the zoo and I saw ostriches doing it. And so I don't really like them. Abby, look at the duck. Adam, no. Come here. Adam, you're scaring them. Okay. Let's go in. I wanted to pet something. Ah. Oh, here comes one. He scares me with his horns. Touch it. <laughs> Is that a cow? Ew, he's licking his butt. Ew. Okay, let's leave. What? Oh, my dad. Hello? How are you doing? We're at the zoo. Who are you with? Just Aubrey. Randy. What are you doing I'm staying home. Alright, well, I'm just working on that one. Okay, sounds good. I'll call you later. Okay. Love ya. Bye. Bye. Oh, yeah. What are you gonna tell him? What, that we're back together? I'm gonna see how it goes for a while first. I don't want him to get mad if something happens. Nothing should happen. Right? Nothing better happen. Like what? You. Why is it always me? It's <laughs> always me. I know it is. You never do anything bad. You're perfect. Give it up a couple of months or a year. We'll tell him when eventually. I know I have to tell my dad about me and Adam, but I'm just not ready yet. Now that I ended things with Jordan, you want to stand up? Joe and I are getting along a lot better. <laughs> what are you doing? There he goes. Let's crack it up. <sighs> I think there's stuff that we still need to talk about. Uh huh. You think we could talk later? You can treat me to dinner, and you and we can talk. I hear out of your mind. What? No, I'm not. I do want to make things better with Joe for Isaac's sake. So while Janet and Eddie watch the baby, I agreed to go out with him. So how do you feel about our relationship right now? When I found out you were dating this douchebag, I was very upset. 
I felt like you kind of did it out of spite. I didn't do it out of spite, first of all. Okay. And I'd be upset too if I found out that you were dating someone else, but I didn't really think about it. Now I do. Now I look at, look back and see, okay. I just feel like it was a huge just slap in my face. Well, I still love you, um, but I don't think either one of us have been happy for a really long time, so, you I know. I was happy when we had Isaac. It was just, just recently, it's not. Up until Isaac was like three months, we were fine. We were doing great, taking care of the baby. We were working together good and everything. And I don't know what just happened. I don't know what happened. And I just, I just don't see why I can't go back to the way it was. We were fine. Right now, I'm not, to be honest, I'm not even, I'm concerned about working, making money, and going to school. I mean, do you honestly think that we would be okay if we got back together right now? I just want to have my family back together and be happy and... I'm glad Joe and I are getting along, but I'm not sure we're ready to get back together. Right now, my mom has custody of Jace, but I've still been spending lots of time with him. Oh, ow, he's just... Oh, you headbutted me at my cheek. It's Friday night, and on Saturdays, I get to babysit Jace by myself. Normally, I go straight home after work, but tonight, my mom says she watched Jace while I hang out with friends. Dang, what you got? <laughs> Aha, I got 22, bitch. 22 loses, jackass. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> hey, guys. Hey, what's up? What's up? Hello. This is Kiefer. This is Kareem, my girlfriend, and this is Rick. Rick Hello. Hi. Hi, I'm Janelle. How you guys doing? I'm fine. Are you, are you sure? Mm hmm Y'all sure y'all fine? Mm-hmm. Right. Just want y'all to be comfortable, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> 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 oh, God. Oh, that's funny. So, uh, where are you from, Janelle? I'm from here, Oak Island. We're originally from Pennsylvania. Yeah, I'm from New Jersey. So you're a Yankee, I like Yankees. Jace, come on, get go to bed. Lay down. Come on, time for bed. Lay down. Mm -hmm. Mamay going to bed. And Jace go to bed. Okay, because Mamay's got to go to work tomorrow. Good night. Are you in school? We're about to start college. Yeah? I didn't graduate high school. But I'm still sexy. Shut up. I think she's the one. Really? <laughs> I know I should go home early since I'm babysitting Jace in the morning. But I think I just found a reason to stay out a little longer. Get up. I told my mom I'd be home last night since I'm babysitting today, but I stayed out all night with Kiefer, the guy I met at the party. Ready, set, go. Ooh. Okay. Mmm, yum, yum. Oh, where the hell have you been, Janelle? Come here. All you're gonna do is yell. Where have you been? All you're gonna do is yell. Look at your damn neck, all the hickeys all of your oh neck. Oh my Ugh. god. Yeah. That's nice, nice job, Janelle. You got all the hickeys all over her neck, like a little. Leave me alone! No! Your mother's a bad girl. Bad, bad, bad. Are you done? You better, uh, like, put something on your neck. That's disgusting. Mom, leave me alone! Janelle! What? You know what, Janelle? I'm gonna make arrangements for Saturdays, and I'm gonna find a babysitter, and guess what? And guess what? You're gonna have to call Stop. me. Stop! You're gonna have to call Stop. me. Stop! You're gonna have to call me to see this baby. Where's the baby? Right here. Can't you even talk to the baby, or are you just going too hungover? You think you're gonna lay around here all day? I don't think so. Jace is gonna be with me today. No, he's not. Uh, why not? Cause you're so. 
hung over. So I'm not hung over. Well, what are you? I'm tired. Yeah. I have a headache. I feel like I got throw up. Yeah, you're hung over. Yeah, I can't leave him with you. Staying out all night probably wasn't a good idea. Now I've lost my one day to hang out with Jace. Corey and I have both been anxious about Allie because until she gets the MRI, we won't know what's wrong with her. But I'm glad we're going through this together. Where's Mommy Valley Girl? <gasps> There's Mommy Valley Girl. I'm so glad that the girls brought us back together. Yeah, like, me too. I think Allie brought us really close. Yeah, I, I think that's what it was. So I was doing some thinking. I think that we should move back in together. Are you serious? Mm-hmm. Like me, you, Allie, and Leah living in our own little house, mm -hmm. no parents. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, I know it's kind of fast and stuff, but I just think we should move in together and have our family all together. You sure? Mm-hmm. 110% positive? 110.9. Like, are you going to be staying in my place? I think we should just start over in a new place somewhere closer to work. Okay. I'm excited. <laughs> I did. My dad called to say he was stopping by, and I'm nervous he knows something's up. Luckily, Adam just left to go work on his cars. Charles. Yeah? Where you at? I'll come down there. Bring my little peanut down here. Okay. Well, you dressed up for me. <laughs> Come here. I you guys all look like you just got up. What have you guys been doing? Nothing. What's going on? I've been hearing things. I hear rumors. Well, what are you hearing? That you are back with Adam. Why would in God's green earth would you get back with him? Obviously because he seems different. Every time you think, oh, it's better this time, a week later, you call me in the middle of the night, Nothing was better. I wouldn't let, let you move back up here if I thought you would even think of it. I w didn't even think I would think about it. Then what changed? Dad, people... Oh. People what? This is why I don't tell you, because instead of like you talking to me nice, you just... Well, how can I be happy about that? Don't be happy. I don't expect you to be happy, but... It makes me sick. Dad, he's really good with her now. Oh, okay, he can be good with her. The only reason you get back together with someone is because you love them and you want to be with them. I do. There's no way in hell you could love him. The, I don't think this is getting us anywhere besides like causing a fight between us. But you know what's wrong? It's just a bad decision. It's not that. It's like I was not over him all the way and he, he came back. I just don't understand how you could even look at him and think, wow, this might work. You treated me like for months, years. I think I'll give it another go. And yeah, he can be a good father, but it always, it's gonna end up with you guys fighting. Bad fighting. It's gonna end up fighting in front of her. It's not just you that I worry about with you and Adam. And I can't be around him. I wish my dad would just give Adam another chance, but it's not looking good. I'm not sure what I'm going to do about Joe, but right now I need to focus on starting college. I'm staying here for school, but most of my friends are going away, so I want to spend time with them while I can. This is weird. It's like August already. I mean, and we're school here. in three weeks. I'm afraid to go away, but you don't have to leave. Yeah, but I, all my friends are leaving, so what's here for me? What do you even need for college? I don't even freaking know. Don't what's you need tax to hang up pictures? I don't oh. know what if my walls are concrete. I have no idea. I wish I could decorate a dorm. Scissors. I do need scissors. Notebooks. What color do you want? White. Do you want these? One yeah, inch? three of them. That's all you're going to buy? I need index cards. Since you're like with him all day, when are you going to study? He's either going to go to daycare or have a babysitter. How are you going to pay for that? We'll figure it out. So what happened with the whole Jordan thing? Are you still like together? No. You've always got Joe. Joe's gonna love you forever, so. Maybe things will work out with him now. Who knows? Oh, the joys of shopping with the child. Let's see how much this is gonna be. <laughs> wow, this is gonna be a lot. 
$176.50. How are you paying for all this? My parents are paying for it. <laughs> Lucky Tally. you. It's $56.13. That was like one third of what you spent. I know. How are you paying for this? For my bank account? I'll probably have an overdraft. <laughs> The cost of being a student and a mom is adding up fast. I know I messed up by staying out all night, so I'm trying to be patient with my mom's nagging. But Kiefer and I have been talking, and I think we're going to hang out again. I hope meeting this guy doesn't change about you going to school and staying out late, because it's really important that you finish your associate's degree. And I hope he's decent, because you always seem to pick the wrong guy. No, I don't. So now what do I expect? His name is Kiefer, and I think we might start dating. Well, I hope he's not a pothead. I hope, oh, my God. I just hope this time of your life, I think it's better off that you would get your life together for this baby. Well, bring him by, and I'll critique him. Before I let my mom critique this new guy, I need to see if I really like him. Today, we're going on our first real date. What's up, girl? How you doing? Good. How are you doing? All right. You think there's any alligators in this lake? I've never seen an alligator. No, but I can bring you to one. Where at? It's like right down the road from here. Really? I can't eat this, dude. Look at that. Keep looking for me. It's dripping everywhere. Look at where it's dripping. <clears throat> Look at it again. Look how bad that's running. I knocked some of it off. On the table? You're gonna lose your... <laughs> you want me to show you the gator? How do you know he's gonna be there? Because he's always guaranteed to be there. You yeah. wanna go right now? Where is he? Holy Oh, look there at he him. is. Dude, it's a alligator. He's gonna be my friend now. I'm gonna go check him out. Come here, buddy. Look at him. Don't, Kiefer, get back. Come here, alligator. Kiefer. You want some dark meat, alligator? Keep your stop, because he has his mouth open. He wants to eat me really bad. Like that? There's something about this guy I really like. Ever since my dad found out about Adam, he's been keeping a close eye on me, which is awkward because Adam's always here. Today, he's going out to get a filter for our air conditioner, which just broke down. It's like 85 in here. Hey. You should go get that filter now. Sure. Is that my dad? Oh my god. Adam, go really stop being hide, dumb. Do you want me to do hide? Go get dressed I'm and go. go. Hide. I'm Did I say hide. hide? I didn't even know he was coming. You didn't call. You didn't say to call you. Well, Adam's What? Oh god, that's scary. Dad. Hey, Munchkin. Hey, you. Oh. Oh, <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, we're running some errands. It's so hot in there. What is it, running? The filter is like bad. He's going to go get one now. Yeah, it's a good side. Have you seen her scoot yet? No. I didn't. Abby, come here. What the hell? Oh my God, Chelsea? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> that was a real crawl. She's like, it's hot, Mom. <laughs> Hurry up with that filter. Well, the filter isn't going to make your air conditioner work. It should be working right now. Without wow. a filter or yeah. anything? Then what the hell is going on? I don't know. Are you going to go look at that? Yeah. Adam's here, Dad. You can stay out while I'm here. My dad's down there. He said that's not going to make the air conditioning work, because it should be working right. Don't go down there. you got to get out of here. <gasps> Bye, Dada. Do you want to bring this to Papa? This isn't going to do anything? It's running. It's running. All I did is flick the switch up. Oh, my God. See? You need your dear old dad. I know. I do need my dad, but I need Adam, too. I just wish they could both figure out how to get along. Today, Corey's parents are watching the girls while we go to a barbecue at a friend's house. So I think me and Corey's going to move in together. What do you guys think? He put you through a lot. But then it. again, you put him. But then again, you put him through a lot too. Okay. But this time, it's for real. 
How do you know it is for real though? Our main focus now is the girls. We know that, you know, that's what really matters, not him doing this or me doing that. Living together, that's a big step. Yeah, it is. I'm screaming at each other every day on the phone to living together. Y'all think you're gonna make things work out? Yeah, I'm pretty sure this time will be because where Allie's got those problems, she needs us both to be together, not fighting and stuff. But I mean, that's why, that's what really I did it was for the girls. Are you in love with her? Or? Yeah, I'm in love with her, I reckon. About time. Is that ketchup? Yep, ketchup and mustard. I slaved over this grill for 30 is. minutes. OK, well, I got a speech, OK? Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad that Lee and Corey back together, because then I don't have to worry about her cuddling with me or bitching all the time. So I'm pretty <laughs> sure. Amen. Yeah. Cheers. After everything we've been through to get here, it feels good to have the support of our friends. Hey. Hey, baby. What'd your dad say about Adam being here? He actually didn't say as much as I thought he would say. Really? I mean, like, I already knew he didn't like him and doesn't want to be around him, but... That's about it. When I saw his, my dad's like car pull up, I was like, oh my god. That feeling in your chest? Yeah. I was like, <laughs> Adam just doesn't realize like how like serious my dad takes it. Like yeah. Adam was like kidding around and stuff. What, like my dad like doesn't like him because of what he did. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And it's not a joke. Like it's not funny. No. When I was downstairs or whatever, like getting ready, and your dad was down there. And I said, Adam brought the filter, and he goes, I'm not going up there. He already saw me once, and I was like, oh. I don't know. I don't know what to do. Like, I want my dad to come around, but I want to see what happens with Adam. But oh. I just want them both. Have your cake and eat it, too. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm looking at the <laughs> Are you still really excited about hair school? Yeah, I've always been excited about hair school. I mean, I'm just not excited about, like, the high school stuff I finish. Mm -hmm. But I gotta finish it, so it doesn't really matter if I'm excited or not. I just gotta do it. Tickle, tickle, tickle. You have mommy? Will you do my math? Yeah. Yeah. It sounds like you yeah. <laughs> I have less than a month to finish all my high school work if I want to start beauty school. But with Adam back in my life, it's hard to focus. What are you crying for? You're not a monkey. Put your feet on the floor. Joe's not working today, so he's watching Isaac. School's starting soon, and I'm worried about my tuition payments. So I'm going in to see what I owe and when. Yeah, thank you, you too. Next, please. Hi. Hello. OK, so I know my tuition is due soon, and I was wondering if you can go over like the payment. OK, thing. do you have an ID on you? Yeah. Yeah, that's me. OK, your total bill is 1526. OK. What we do offer, you can do a payment plan for the balance. Okay. You take the full balance and divide it into five equal payments. Okay. okay, one monthly payment would be $305.20. Okay. okay. That you would have to pay this week. Okay. Is that something you think you no. can do? Mm -hmm. You can't do that. Do you know about what you could afford to pay this week? Nothing. You have Not nothing this week. at all. Mm -mm. Okay. Would you have something by the due date of August 3rd? Yeah. What would you be able to afford to pay by then? Probably only one payment. One payment? Like, we, like 300. OK. Is it an option for you to maybe take less credit hours to lower your bill? No, I don't want to drop any credits at all. You don't want to drop any no. credits at all, unless there's somebody you can borrow money from until that's done that you can pay them back. That's the personal decision up to, okay. up to you. So here's your estimate. OK, um, thank you. You're welcome. Good luck. Hello? Hey. Hey, what's up? So I got back from the financial aid office. And my total for tuition and fees is 1500 and then I, if I can, I'm supposed to pay 300 this week or 600 next week. Do you have that? No. What, how are you going to get it? That's what I don't know. I don't know where I'm going to get the money. I just know I need to come up with it fast. Janelle, 
7.30. Today I'm dropping off Kiefer at the DMV to get his ID while I go to an appointment with my college advisor. So, are you going to see uh, Kiefer today? Yeah, I'm picking him up when I leave. You're never going to be in time for school. You better get going now. I'm leaving right now. Oh, Jace, what do you got now? Lordy hallelujah. Now what are you doing? Forgot something. You're gonna be late. I forgot something. Okay, you got, well, yeah, that's a lot of traffic. All right, well, I'm leaving. In the hey, don't speed on shipyard. Okay. They got the okay. They got those cameras. Mom, okay. Got them I know cameras. the cameras. I know. You get a ticket. Good morning. Good morning. Text me. All right. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, 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 wait. I'm gonna be late for school, Kiefer. I got it. Never oh. Ah, you suck. <laughs> <laughs> you need more practice right in front of the DMV. They know they're gonna come out and take your license now. <laughs> you dumbass. <laughs> Even though my mom was freaking out about me being late, I made it to my meeting with my advisor just in time. So, we have your high school transcript. Mm -hmm. Okay, and I reviewed your transcript. You're, you're a very good student. Mm -hmm. very Thank good you. Student. What do you plan to do? Well, I um, plan on doing um, film editing. I think you've selected a, a, a good program. You know, it's, it's important that you like what you're going to do oh, in your yeah. career, that you love what you're going to do yeah, when you start Yeah, because if out. you don't, you're just gonna be so bored with That's it. That's right. We encourage you to be in every class, mm -hmm. every day. That's understandable. Okay. So what's the cost for the full semester? If you look at the tuition chart, so full-time tuition, 664.50, all the student fees are included in that. Yeah. Okay. So are there any other questions I can answer for you? No, nope, that's about it. Okay. Well, it was a nice meeting you. Thank you. And welcome. Welcome to Cape Pierce. I knew adding a new guy to the equation wouldn't throw me off course. I just have to prove it to my mom. Today, while Corey's mom watches the girls, we're going to look at houses. Small and green. This is a kitchen. This one's a lot prettier. The house looks like the area. Finally, we saw one that's right near the water company where Corey works, and it's perfect for our family. We decided to sign the lease on the spot. So when we can we start getting in here? Immediately. Okay. <laughs> I'm having lunch with my mom, who's been out of town. She's less than thrilled at the news that Corey and I signed a lease. What makes you think, you and Corey both, that you can make this work? Because I think we're both ready. This time, he's not the only one in it, I'm in it too. Well, I will tell you, I don't agree with your quick decision to jump in and move in together. Y'all could have took it slow. Yeah, but it's kind of hard to take it slow when you have two kids. Well, that might be true, wanna, but Lord, you, you know, could have at least waited two weeks. Eliana. So with that being said, what's the place look like where y'all are moving? We have to fix it up a little bit. Oh. I don't want y'all to jump into something that's gonna cause more problems. Because for one, y'all got enough on your plate with the babies and Allie having her medical problems without jumping into something that could be a disaster. I'm happy that Corey and I are moving in together. I just wish I could say the same for my mom. As hard as it's been trying to explain it to my dad and Megan, I'm so happy things are going well with Adam. Do you want her? Okay. It's nice having help. You do everything. I know. I have a feeling that's how it's going to be. You do everything? Or you'll do something and say it's my turn. I'll do it. And I'll say it's your turn. You'll be like, excuse me. Uh, I've been doing it for like six months. I have been doing it for six months. Yeah, she is like, no. yeah, dad. So, I like to be around my girls every day. We. Move in together, it'll be good. I love you. You love me, I think. <laughs> and I know she loves me. Uh, I don't know if you can move in yet. I still have to talk to Megan about it, but yeah. I think I want you to. I know I don't want to. <laughs> I think she wants you to. What are you going to tell your dad? 
I'm not telling him right away. Why? What do you think he's gonna say? He's gonna crap his pants. Why? <laughs> okay, are you ready to go? You can't start coming around a lot and then disappear, because that's bad for her. I know. You're not gonna get rid of me this time. Okay. Mm -hmm. This afternoon, my mom's watching Jace while I meet up with Kiefer for lunch. Two chicken ready. Two chicken ready. Ready to. Ready to. That dude can't learn to cook like me. I would have had all the water, so I had to make a whole restaurant would have been fed already. That's <laughs> Janelle. Janelle is red. Screaming my name. <laughs> okay. So I'm glad we met each other. I'm glad we did too. So where are you going with your life? You don't want me to feel about it, Eric? You really? Yep. Yeah. She's like hot <laughs> All types are out of my league. No. So are we going to keep on hanging out? Yeah. You down? Yeah, you are right now. Yes. Do you mind, you know, dating me even though I have a child? Are you sure? It's nice that I finally met someone cool who's okay with me being a mom. I know I started dating really fast, but I can see he's a good person. And he knows about Jace. He understands my responsibilities with Jace. Has he met Jace yet? No, not yet, but I think um, introduce him to my mom and Jace soon. What do you think she's gonna think? I don't know. Since money's tight, I picked up an extra shift at work, and my mom agreed to come get Isaac. Hello. Hi. Hi, baby. Are you going to come play with Nona today? So how'd you make out at the school? I had to make a $600 payment, which I don't have the money for. Can you help me out at all? I don't have the money right now, honey. I'm going to have to ask somebody. What are you going to ask? I guess I could ask Joe, but I really don't want to no. because we're not together. I'm gonna be late for work, so. All right. Are you ready to go play? Thank you, Joe will pick him up then. Okay. Janet and Eddie have already done so much for me, I don't wanna ask them for the money. And since Joe works full time, it looks like asking him may be my only option. Hey, Joe. Yeah. Do you think I could borrow some money for school? How much? 600. You gonna pay me back? Yeah, I'll pay you back. Double? No. Not double. Uh, I really hate asking you for money. But you're the only person I can ask right now. And by when? Two days. I think I could do that. Thanks. Despite everyone's concerns, Corey and I are moving into our place today. We might go ahead and start redoing this real wall later. Huh? Put another coat over it? Yeah, you can. And our friends volunteer to help out while Corey's mom watches the girls. We've almost got it done. I want to get in the river. You guys want to jump in the river? Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> Don't forget about the coffee table and the tables. Okay, sure thing. We're done. Finally, that was the last thing. What are you doing? Y'all back together with your man. It's way out of it. Yeah. Uh -huh. All right, well, we're going to get out of here. All right, thanks. Right. See y'all later. Okay. Bye, you guys. Bye, y'all. 
Do you like your new house? Me, you, sissy, and daddy. Me, you, sissy, and daddy. Yeah. Yay. Say yay. Uh, yay. Oh. <laughs>Now that things are serious with me and Kiefer, I decided to take him to meet my mom and Jace. I just hope it goes okay. Are you excited to meet my mom, Kiefer? Uh, I'm excited and terrified at the same time. Which is kind of crazy, but I do want to see Jace. Me too. I get along with kids. This is Kiefer. Hi. How, oh, watch out. Hi. I saw that, Kiefer. Nice to meet you. <laughs> so what's going on? Nothing much. <laughs> <laughs> He's a ticklish little <laughs> But that's Kiefer. He's from New Jersey. Now, are your parents here? No, I came down here by myself. I came down here with a bag of clothes and walked here from South Myrtle Beach. 40 pound bag of clothes. Now you working? Technically, I'm laid off right now, but I, I know how to do so many things, it's easy to find a job. I'm never unemployed much. And he also took like two classes in culinary school. I can walk into any kitchen around here pretty much and cook with my resume, so. But I, I, I pretty much got it figured out. Kid is adorable. Thank you. Won't take his eyes off oh, me. No. Either. <laughs> Won't take his eyes off me. <laughs> I think that went okay, but with my mom, you never know. She needs your diaper change. There's a little turd in there. Oh my gosh, baby, you smell. You think you'd get used to the smell? But you don't. It's you different don't. every day. I want Adam to move in, but I'm worried Megan won't like the idea. I have to talk to her about it. I talked to Adam, and I think we're gonna work back together and everything. But he asked me if he can move in. To our house? Yeah. And what did you say? I said, I need to talk to Megan. When did you guys even get back together? Like a couple days ago? Yeah. Because I kind of want to, because that's like kind of the picture I always had in mind yeah. since I got pregnant about having like the little family. Mm hmm. And what would my dad think? If Adam moved in? Mm -hmm. I'm not telling them. What do you think? I don't know. I think it's really soon. Very soon. It seems like, oh, so much is going on. We just got back together from like a really bad breakup. Yeah, like five months apart, four or five months apart. And then a day he says, I miss you. And then everything's like, everything changes. What makes you trust him? Like to move in and that he's like honestly changed. And... Well, I mean, he's like wanting to take this big step. Was it his idea? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> what do you think? It's going to be bad. Now that I've got the money from Joe, I'm going into school to make my tuition payment. Okay, All right, come on over. How are you? Good, how are you? Doing great. What can I do for okay, you? so I owe $600 for my... Tuition? Yeah. Three more payments of three hundred and twenty dollars and thirty-three cents. Thank you. You're very welcome. You have a great day. I'm really grateful to Joe for helping me out with my tuition. Thank you. Hello. What's she doing? I know you're you cranky. Huh? Did yes, you he did. He did. Oh yeah. When? He gave me a big mess this morning because I think he ate some carrots. Oh, it was um. Sweet potato. Ew. You sweet potato. You want your parents to be together. You want them to be happy. I know we're not together right now, but I know things are going to work out. I hope so. I really do. I'm pretty confident things will fall into place. To your eyes, everything is perfect. You by my side.
On the next Teen Mom 2. I don't have one baby, I have two babies. But that's not fair, he should help. When do you watch him? Whatever you name me. The last thing I want is to be coming home from work listening to this bickering. So you and Joe are gonna move out and live together. Like, how crazy is that? Me and Megan talk. You can stay here. Daddy's moving in today. How the hell are you gonna hide that from Dad? I have to stop by the college and drop off this form. She said you have to sign it. Why should I do anything for you? My mom never even tells me she loves me.